right we are loading into skype so peace of christ to all of you please invite your friends and uh, you know uh, before we start i saw a muslim saying hey princess where are you calling me princess my friend i am not the one who put eyeliner three times a day like your prophet i am not the one who received quran wearing women clothes i am not the one who pee like a woman and I am not the one who men kiss him down his belly and he say, yes, right there. So, if you want to talk about princes, well, obviously we know which princes we are talking about. Uh, let us see. Um, all right. Uh, my my Skype is open. If there is any Muslim want to call us and tell us why he's a Muslim, well, then we will be happy to have you and we will be listening. Now, from time to time, I receive emails or requests from people. Can you res respond to this guy? Can you respond to that guy? Then I ask myself, what's wrong with those Christians? Are you all of a Christian? Are you a potato maybe like Muslims? Why you cannot answer them to yourself? Okay, we have Mr. Rashid. How are you, Mr. Rashid? Hello, Christian Prince. How are you, my friend? Wait a, a moment. Please wait. I put my Bluetooth. All right. <clears throat> Hello, Christian Prince. Yes, I hear you. Go ahead. What do you like to say to us? Why you are a Muslim, Rashid? Uh, good uh, good evening, because uh, I'm in Europe right now, All right. Uh, not the U.S. So for, us, for us, it's almost uh, evening too, yeah. All right. Salam to all the Muslims, uh, salam just to the, to the Muslims, okay. not to the Christians. All right, wonderful. So why you cannot say salam to the Christians? Uh, because if I do that, then uh, I am a hypocrite, because mm -hmm. the Quran does not allow us to, you know. Yeah, but you live in England, right? You're in Europe, where you live? I, I live in uh, Finland. Mm. And uh, did you uh, take an oath when you took your passport to be a Finnish uh, a citizen that you will protect the kingdom and you will obey the law? Uh, no, 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 no. Mm -hmm. I am not an asylum seeker. I come here uh, legally, like uh, from work, because uh -huh. I am originally from Nigeria. Oh, okay. All right. Anyway, yeah, my friend, okay. We, we, yes, we yes, yes. We don't care if you say salamu alaikum or not because we do not need it from you anyway. It is you, it's yes, you Muslims yes, who yes. seek uh, salam with us, not the opposite. So, anyway, why, okay. why you are a Muslim? Well, uh, I was born into Islam and uh, I think it's the right religion because, uh, and I believe the Prophet is the seal of prophets, and because the Christianity has been. Uh, uh, corrupted so uh, Islam came with the truth okay and I believe in it okay well, uh, Christianity is corrupted what is that uh, do you mean like the Bible is corrupted um necessarily I don't really think like the Bible is very corrupted I think some things no, the question is very changed. simple Rashid. you know we, we are adult I don't like to jump over yes yes questions. I know either I know, you I say know. it's corrupted there's nothing is called little corrupted or you know either it's corrupted or not because little corruption means okay. it's corrupted I feel uh, there are some part in the Bible where it is the way it was before, but there are some things that also be corrupted and changed. Okay, that so, is what so I believe. Why, so why your prophet he says that he agree with what we have? Uh, that was uh, the with the Torah, the Old Testament, no, not the New no, Testament. No, that's not true, because simply it okay. says uh, uh, he is speaking about the Christians and the Jews believing in what they have with them, the people of the book. Yeah, yeah but that was to the it was when he sat down i know the passage you're talking about yeah. was when the jews invited him no about no there he sat down on the no. pillow uh no. little no. no what part are you talking about no you see chapter 2 verse number 87 it's it's mentioned moses and isa and isa we supported him by the holy spirit and then right after that he says and when a book came confirm what is with them which means is mentioning the christian and the jews so the Christian and the Jews are mentioned in the verse before it. The verse after it says, "And the you know, and when a book came, confirm what is with them." So where you are making things? Show like, me, show me, show me, show I'm me. Showing the you one I know. Chapter two, verse number wait. eighty-seven. Open your Quran from your side. Okay, wait a moment. 
Wait, sorry. <laughs> One moment, please, sorry. Uh, chapter what? Chapter two, the cow chapter. The, the cow, yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, oh. The Hindu, the Hindu right. chapter, yeah. Yeah, no, not the Hindu chapter. What do you mean? Well, this is the cow chapter. Yeah, but the, there's nothing uh, with related to Hindu here. No, it it's is. just the, no, it the is cow. Because how Allah he, he resurrect people from there? Okay, okay. What is the the verse? The verse. I, I told you, chapter two, verse number eighty-seven. You are not concentrating. Take it easy. I'm concentrating. Calm yeah. down. And your God, Allah, He resurrect people from death by hitting them by beef. This is Hindu. The body cow. <laughs> what? Yeah, the, the, the cow, the cow give life. How Allah resurrect people? Why it's called the chapter of the cow? Are you telling me you do not know? Are you telling me you do not know? Wait, that the let's cow chapter... focus on the... Yeah, we, we, Wait, we, we will go there after, the after one, we yeah. finish this one, no problem. You are telling me, sorry, I'm opening it, uh, 87. Yeah. Hmm. I never know anything about resurrecting people with uh, meat. Yeah, with not meat, well, you have to do it with beef, cow specifically. Otherwise, you are not a Hindu then. Because the, the cow, the, the Hindu cow, is the one who gives life, not your God. Hmm. Okay, I've seen it. And uh, okay. yeah, so you're right. chapter 2, verse 37, speaking about the Christian and the Jews. And then the verse, I read two verses, it says, Wait, I'm going to read it. Indeed, we gave Moses the book and sent it after him to say his messengers, and we gave Jesus. Is a son of a clear person speaking in the Holy Spirit. Why is it that every time a messenger comes to you, Israelite, with something you do not like, you become arrogant, rejecting some and killing others? Yeah, but this is about the Jews. Wait, a Christian prince is talking to this is about the Jews, not no, the friend. Christians we have now because they have no, changed no, everything. No, no, it's mentioned that we gave Moses and we and Jesus. So, and then a book came confirming what is with them, them, them them which mean the jews and the christian it doesn't say with the jews it says with them them who the one who mentioned previously the one who follow moses and the one who they are believing in jesus so book confirming what is with them hmm. okay wait, oh, we, can I, wait, I tried to... we can show you wait no verses. wait 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 i read it again okay read it again we gave moses the book and sent after him to say for messengers <laughs> And we gave Jesus Ibn Mahdi clear to present to him with the Holy Spirit. Why is it a Holy Spirit? Mm. Huh? Wait, Holy Spirit. Mm. I don't think uh, Allah. I don't think Allah is a spirit, and <laughs> what? And I don't think Allah has a spirit, and. Uh, so this passage is talking about the Holy Spirit. Uh... Hmm. Okay, I see a, I see a point. Yes, I see a point. I see a point. Okay, it gave uh, the book. It confirmed the book. That does not mean the Bible cannot be changed. You understand, Christian Prince? Because we know that the the christians have always involved the religion with politics i know uh, muslims do uh, that too but the christ i know muslims my friend, my friend, do that you, too are you adult mature or you are a kid it says confirm what is with them so is the bible corrupted or not i think it's corrupted so, this is so talking about 1400 so years so ago why your god lying but because this is the book in the time of the christians still we have it in the 600 years no after. no 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 you don't have it so many things well, okay, have been changed okay, even the even okay, the jews on, says hold, the same hold thing hold on in the time if you're a prophet he says the christian they say that the messiah is allah the same book the messiah is allah al Masihu allah so the same quran says that the christian believe that the messiah is allah and the jews believe that uzair is the son of allah the same book and you are the one who said that he was conf you know confirming only the Jewish Jewish book, but the Jews they believe at that time according to your Quran that there is a guy his name is Ozair, and uh, you know and the Jews they believe he is the son of God. And this is a chapter nine, verse number thirty. 
I, I never know any Jews that say that, so uh, yeah, I, I don't I, think... I, I, yeah. I, I agree with you. I never know a Jew saying... And there is I, no... I know G, uh, Christians say that, but I never heard any I Jews know. Your, your, your prophet compare is, anybody your to prophet God. Is, yeah, because... I, we, know, we know that your prophet is mentally ill, and he say whatever he wish, you know? No, don't say that, Christian, please. I, 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 I just not? want okay. to have a... You see, I'm, I'm... No, 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 you cannot have any insult. If you prove to me this is wrong, it's okay, but let's not go to insult, because no, I respect you. Lot, I'm, not insulting, okay, I'm not insulting my friend it, it, all your books say is that Muhammad is mentally ill okay let me ask you when somebody has yeah. sex and he imagine he have sex but in fact he did not have sex is that a mental illness or not like a sex dream no he's a, he, no he's awake he's awake he's not having sex a dream he's awake and he go around and he tell people that I had sex with my wife and then later we find that he did not touch any of them so if this guy is so crazy, he's hallucinated to the point he do not know what is real and what is fake when he is awake, not when he is asleep. Read it. Wait, wait. I have never. This is Sahih al Bukhari. Proof, yeah. This is Sahih al Bukhari saying, once yes. the prophet, prophet was bewitched, so he began to imagine that he had done a thing which, in fact, he had not done. Do you see it? Hmm. hmm. Yes. Okay. Once so, the this is is, is that, this Sahir Sahir Al Bukhari. Okay. Yeah, this is okay. Sahir Bukhari. You know Sahir Bukhari. Bukhari yes. is. Uh, wait, I I read. Wait, I read it. Yeah, wait. Once the Prophet was bewitched, so that he began to imagine that he had done it. Yeah. Which yeah, but this is just talking about the Prophet was doing. There was there's nothing that I talk about sex here. Oh, you know, I, 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 okay. I, I, I did not tell you there's a story. I was going to Walmart to do shopping, and then I saw Aisha, and she told me that my husband, his name is Muhammad. He imagined himself having sex. In fact, he did not do that. And here we go. This is what she told me. Read with me carefully. Yes. Okay. Read. I read what? Read. It's in front of you. Wait, wait, wait. I had never seen it. The prophet continued for such and such period, imagining that he had slept, had sexual relationships with his wife. And in fact, okay, okay, I see, I see, I see. Okay, so is that... Is this that... is Sahir Bukhari, okay. Yeah, this is Sahir Bukhari, yeah. We can get it from McDonald's. Now, what we will do, so... Is can you put the Arabic version? I, I I, want to show it to my wife, please. Just the Arabic well, version. Your wife, because, she speak uh... Arabic? Your wife, she speak Arabic? Uh, yeah, she is uh, Egyptian. Oh, okay, let her read for us. Go ahead. Can you read this first? Start what it says. Okay, okay. All right. Uh, I okay. I uh, yes. Oh, it's yes. right. It, it's right. But uh, wait. Uh, some you know we men sometimes we dream about uh, you know having a sexual relationship with women. Uh, it's just normal. You know what? I once just I, like, no. Once I I had a dream that I have a you know a sexual relationship with my uh, refrigerator. What are you talking about? This is a guy. He is imagining himself having sex with his wives when he's awake. This is not in a dream. And he go around and say to his wife, did you like it? She said, like what? You did not even touch me. Because if a person just see a dream, this is a dream. He wake up, he knew that he was in a dream. This guy, he go around, he think he did something, but he, in fact, he did not. So obviously your prophet is mentally ill. Hmm. Well, this is uh, this is very surprising. Uh, hmm. I knew he was sick, sick, uh, poisoned, but I never knew he was uh, bewitched with uh, black magic. Uh, do you think the poison? I don't know. Do you think the poison he went down to his ear and then to the throat and then come back to his brain? Well, it's uh, I think it's uh, scientifically proven that it's possible for uh, poison to actually affect your your, your memory, your brain. Ah. Uh, I think that is possible. Yes, uh, yeah. yes, that is proof. But okay. I am not going to try to uh, say, oh, that maybe that's the reason because that is just uh, very, very uh, unfortunate. Okay, okay. Uh, imagine sex. But uh, I feel this is just a, uh, a little time in his life. I don't think this went what on for uh, time? Uh, Ac According to Muslims, it took Allah 12 months to release 12 knots 
the, the Jewish guy he did to him so he made it 12 knots and it took Allah one month to release every knot from Muhammad so for for almost a year Muhammad was mentally ill according to this if you go to a hospital for one year of mental illness still you are you know a person obviously he have you know you will not recover I mean they can give you drugs to uh, easy to but nobody can fix your brain so obviously Muhammad you have a mental issue okay mm -hmm. uh, this is right but uh, I my wife the reason I started uh, listening to you is because uh, uh, like a month ago uh, sorry for like over talking but uh, my wife told me she wanted to uh, leave the religion and it was a, a very big problem in uh, my household because okay. I have a, a daughter and a son Hmm. So she told me that uh, what? Yes, yes. She told me that the uh, that the prophet married Aisha at six years old and slept with them at nine because I asked the uh, Sheikh. He said Aisha was eighteen, and during that time, that uh, the way women were perceived like it's not like now. Hmm. So uh, I don't really speak Arabic, and uh, I tried looking for the verse in the Quran that says Aisha was like uh, six, nine, but I never seen it. And my wife said that uh, it's you have it. So can I please see uh, my friend, the part my friend, where it says my friend will my respect your wife. I hope she will leave Islam very soon. And maybe she did already. No, uh, no, she won't because uh, it's not uh, it's just brainwashing because I feel women are easily brainwashed. Ah, OK, so are you things. saying are you yeah. saying your wife is a stupid in the front of her face? No, I'm not saying stupid because they have emotions. You know, we have a daughter who is six years old, okay, so, so that can uh, easily do, like. Uh, do, do men have emotion too or no? We have emotion, but we okay. can. We I just, feel we, we just can showed see. you. We just showed you that you're a prophet himself, and he is a man. He was imagining things never happened, but the wife she did not. So women can be more healthy in the brain than men correct I know this this okay. is far, so but uh, we is know women false. now read with me when the, when your sheikh says to you that Muhammad Maria Aisha at the age of 18 Muhammad was dead at that time my friend Muhammad Maria Aisha oh. when she was 18 Muhammad is dead when she was 17 going in her 18 he died so he married her and then he stayed with her nine nine years after she he died he, he died wait I, I I'm gonna read the, what you have in the screen uh -huh. uh, that the prophet peace be upon him married her when she was six years old and oh, and he consummated his marriage when she was yeah. is this Sahir? Oh, I say Sahir Bukhari. Mm -hmm. Can you please send me the link? I uh, open in my own uh, site here. No problem. If you don't mind, sorry. No problem. Here we go. The link is with you. I haven't sent it yet. But... Okay. Uh, so here, be careful. Okay, the perfect mind when she was six years old and the consummated this marriage for short time. Okay, one moment I'm gonna search the meaning of consummated in the dictionary. Sorry. Mm. Dictionary for what? I want to check the meaning of consummated in the dictionary. So yeah, me consummated and me here have intercourse. He did boom boom. Yes. Okay. So yes, he married her at the age of six, he was molesting her. Kissing her, touching okay. her, play with her, masturbating hmm. until the age of nine, and then he, excuse my language, he did it. Hmm. This is another clear sign that Muhammad is mentally ill because a person who is 54 years old, what he saw in a child. Okay, uh, but in the old times, uh, you know, women. Uh, I will tell you about my grandmother my grandmother at the old time because they grow so fast she said that she got married when she was two weeks old and she did uh, get the bread net and she delivered the child after three weeks 
and then when she became 10 she had like 10 children and yeah that's normal at the old time I and mean, what what are you talking about old time new time a human is a human and now we have more global warming so if it's the weather will change now it's warmer so she is six years old he is fair he's you know actually she is five because six in the Islamic calendar five in our calendar so what made a man at the age of 54 think for a second in someone she is a child you said you have a child yourself right you have a daughter uh, yes my uh, uh, Skype profile it's like my daughter I don't she want to look at six. your daughter I'm uh. saying how old is she uh, she is uh, she'll be six by uh, okay. You know, God, God forbid, imagine, God forbid, imagine somebody coming to your house and asking you to sleep with your daughter, what you would do? No, please, uh, no, not my daughter, because I'm very sensitive with my, my uh, friend, children. My friend, I understand so. this way, I'm asking you about it because you are sensitive, this is your daughter, so you just rejected that, so why you accept to have Muhammad to be a prophet when he does some, something very disgusting? Well, if the uh, I'm never going to try to uh, uh, make it sound uh, uh, make give it a reason. Uh, I don't think it's good, so I'm not going to try to justify that because I have a daughter myself. And uh, okay, uh, but what if uh, like the. I know the the girl is like six years old, but uh, if the father uh, agreed and trust trusted the prophet, peace be upon him, then I don't think there is a real problem even there. When, even is when there? Muhammad he wanted to have her, he went to Abu Bakr, and Abu Bakr he said to him, "But you are my brother." He said to him, "I am your brother in religion, and she is mine." So he forced the guy to take her. <clears throat> This is the part uh, because in Islam there are so many things that I am um, like not happy with. But this is the part I've like tried my best to like pr make sure it's wrong mm. because I'm very sensitive with young children, and this is the part I always pray every day that it's wrong because uh, or it's a lie because I have a daughter myself, and uh, mm. yeah. <clears throat> Can you show me the part where the prophet said that you are just my brother in religion? No problem. That's Abu Bakr. No problem. Please show I will me. Show it to you. you. Okay, let me find it. You are lucky that I'm a person. Everything I have is in my head. I do not need to save them. I can find them in a second. Here we go. The prophet asked Abu, uh, Abu Bakr for Aisha hand and in marriage. Abu Bakr said, but I am your brother. The Prophet, he said, you are my brother in Allah religion, and Aisha is mine. Wahili halal, translation, he says, she is lawful for me. He says, she is mine, she is lawful for me, I will take her, which means he forced the father. Oh, the father is trying to find an excuse to get away from it. And as you see, this is Sahih Bukhari. Wait, I, I read. The Prophet asked Abu Bakr for Aisha sentiment. I said, but I am your brother. Professor is my brother in the last religion in his book, but she actually uh, this I don't think this is this is uh, wrong. You do not date a child. Mm. Um 